What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's Brennan and I'm BMANX45 and today we're coming at you with another video. We are just doing a quick update about the new Digimon Adventure 02, uh, the beginning volume or version 2.0, uh, Tamer Party Packs. This is something that I don't think I talked about, uh, but it came up a, you know, a couple weeks ago around the 17th they announced that they would be doing another um, Tamer Party Pack. So really close to the other one because the other one just happened in November. Uh, November. Uh, if I believe here, yeah, it, yeah, right, the version one. They talked about it in September, but it was gonna, going to be until November events. So I thought we were going to get that Tamer Party pack for a couple months because they said you could get the pack, you know, you know, every month for you know two packs, you know, two kits per month. Uh, my store has still not been able to get more than just the one pack, uh, and it's hard because if you're trying to pull play sets, unfortunately. You don't get it's not like the other one where you got so many copies that you could get easy play sets of the tamer party cards uh if you traded with your friends and stuff like that if they weren't interested in it whereas the um the other one had 12 cards and eight, three cards a pack and eight packs so you didn't you got two of like each one i think was was the average um but from de december one it's gonna be themed and it's basically all the cards that they announced for that new um uh, anniversary kit next uh, January or June sorry uh, another big you know kit um, that they're gonna do so they're gonna do reprints of the we already know we're getting reprints of these that are gonna look way nicer but it's just the fact that the, the, these ones will be available now and they actually already gave these cards away as I think part of a Gen Con thing so some people already have these cards and then now they're getting these versions and stuff like that um, but hey, if you enjoy this type of content, be sure to smash that like button, comment down below. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications so you miss a single minute of the fun. So yeah, we're just going to do a quick update here. And uh, so some of the cards we've already gotten, like I think the Vmon's just a reprint. The Davis is a reprint of the ones we got in the demo deck. Same with uh, Louis and uh, Ukumon. So just nicer foil versions, uh, whereas all the other cards are brand new. Um, I know the Godamon would have been nice for Yellow Vaccine because it gives your opponent's security uh, Digimon minus 2,000 DP on your turn, which is good uh, in the would have been good in the Ultimate Cup format. Uh, there's better cards in the Regionals format, but it would have been cool. Uh, you got new Tamers for all the guys uh, in their co specific colors. Cody is in black, so that's kind of cool. Um, obviously no purple Tamer, but you got Ken, Yoli, uh, Kari, and TK, and then of course Davis. Yeah, and you get new versions of Wormmon, Hawkmon, Gatamon, Patamon, and uh, Armadillomon. So, you know, 14 types of cards, so even more. Three cards per pack. You got to get at least three kits in order to see three kits in order to pull play sets of this. Um, my thing about this is I think that they could have waited a little bit longer, like maybe did this in January, January and February with the next sets um, and allowed us to still get some of the Tamer Party uh, version one cards. I think now there's gonna be a mad rush for people to get all these cards and there's just not enough access to them uh, Which is just kind of sad. So personally, I think they could have done better uh, They're pushing so much stuff on us really quickly and it just feels like Either you know, like they want to you know, they're like, oh, we want more stuff But at the same time you're pushing people out of the game because they can't keep up with how much stuff is going on especially now that they're doing the double packs uh, looks like they're going to do a double pack every set now, which is again, more, just more push and stuff like that. So they're definitely a ramping up production, which I mean, as, as a company, you generally want to do, but you just got to watch out that you don't do too much of it because then you'll lose players because they feel like they can't keep up with the game, uh, when they don't have easy access to a lot of this stuff and some of this stuff doesn't have as easy access to. So you gotta be able to get a store. They can get, uh, tamer party packs. Um, which is hard enough as it is because they don't allow you any way to order Tamer Party Packs. If they let you order, what I think Bandai should do is let you order Tamer Party Packs like you do the pre-release kits, the holiday kit, everything else that they've done, even the tournament kits. If they allowed you to order those, then I think that would be a better idea because then you have a guarantee that you're going to get something because you've made a contract with Bandai to, you know, I'll put on this event, let's perform this. Whereas if you just ask your local uh, distributor if you're, hey, can I get this? They're like, we have more important things to do. We have so many orders to pick. I'll get back to you when I have time. And that's just unfortunate because that where things fall through the crack. And then all of a sudden you find like 
rando random people have gotten all all the support like instead of the store getting the support some random you know guy who you know orders stuff to their their personal self has tons of these cards for sale and you can't even get one to your store to try and get some of the cards for your you know decks you want to build and that's just unfortunate so i personally think that they could do better with the tamer party packs uh, I do like the idea of the beginning of version 2, but I kind of think I would have liked it to come a little bit later in the season. But we'll see what happens. Um, I'm hoping I can pick up some of these packs too, because uh, I definitely do want to see some of these cards in my collection. But tell me what you guys think. Tell me if you are excited for these cards. Are you glad that you were able to get them so quick? We will be able to get them um, in June as reprints in that box, and I think you get two copies of each. So you only have to like necessarily buy two of those to get play sets of everything. And they're going to be nicer foil, you know, foiled out, hollowed out versions of the cards. So it might just be worth it waiting uh, if there's nothing you absolutely need right now for, for gameplay. But uh, tell me what you guys think and uh, we'll keep you updated on any new things that are happening. And uh, hopefully uh, we all get a chance to see some of these cards in action and see if they're any good. Looks like that's all the time we have for this video. Thank you very much for tuning in, and we hope to see you in the next video. And as always, have a wonderful day, and that's all for now, folks.